What's going on, Travis? Calling up here with Victory Chrysler Dodge Jeep and Ram. Here's that 13 Silverado that you were asking about. Now, I'm not going to lie. The bumper's a little rusted on it. I'm just going to point that out to you real quick. It's not pictures on the internet yet that I know of. But this, other than that, I'm not seeing a whole lot wrong with this truck other than that front bumper. But let's kind of go around and look at it together. I do know this one is still to go through our service department as well. Looks like there's a little rust spot right there as well. So say this is a 2013, does have some miles on it, used truck, got rear parking sensors of course. This one does have the backup camera as well. So say four wheel drive Z71 trim. So it looks like there's a little rust bubble spot coming through right here on the truck. So say my GMC's got the same thing right there on both wheel wells in the back. Well let's check these front tires as well. Probably gonna need tires all the way around. Now this one has not been through service yet, so that's something we're probably gonna put on there as well. But let's go dive inside and take a look. No bed cover on this one. It does have the all-weather Chevy floor mats. I mean, this is how fresh this truck is. It ain't even been through detail yet. So they still a little dirty, leather interior. But of course, man, I'm gonna show you exactly how she sits. I ain't gonna lie to you, not that type of person. Let's go up front. Oh, hang on real quick. Scratch right there. All right, coming in here. Looks like this one's got the cooled and heated seats as well. Powerful mirrors. Oh, nope, that's memory seat. That's what that is. Awesome. Cool beans. Four wheel drive on this truck. Let's climb on in and check out this LTZ Silverado. All right, we got cruise control, full voice recognition. You got your volume up and down on the steering wheel. Now this one does have the 4L80 transmission. I do know a little bit about those. So say that's what my truck, I wish my truck had. So say coming in, there's all your in-dash features. Go in and scroll through there. Standard GM radio, nothing special. You got your dual AC controls, rear parking sensors, and you also got the electronic pedal movement there. Now this one does have one of my favorite features of all time. That's the full floor in console. I don't even know if anything's in there, but there's enough room in there to do any kind of activities you wanted to do. All right, back in there, you got your USB and 12 volt as well. So let's kind of start her up. See how many miles are on her. Probably doesn't have a whole lot of fuel in it. All right, helps if I turn the key over all the way. Looks like we got 109. Yeah, I know the fuel level's low. 109,595 on the dash. Pretty good looking truck, man. Let me know what you think. Give me a call, shoot me a text. Here's my cell, 660-492-5030. Again, Travis, that number is 660-492-5030. Thanks, man.